Hello, this is Running Robert, and either welcome or welcome back to Dyson Spear Program in our apparently never-ending quest to build a Dyson Spear. So thank you for joining me. We are actually on part 31 now, so we are getting up there pretty high. If you are just happening onto this video and you are like, what is this game? What is he playing? What is going on here? At about 30 seconds up at the top right, uh, I will have linked to the first video, and at a minute, I will have a link to the playlist. So you can go to either of those, and let's go ahead and get going. So what we have happened here is we are making titanium glass on this planet. Uh, it is needed for the new research I have, so pretty much what we have is water plus uh, titanium equals glass and glass. <laughs> So let me try that one more time. Water, titanium, and glass makes titanium glass. And then pretty much it's getting shipped into the storage facility here where it's going to be flown off uh, to my next station so that I can actually look to make these cubes. But look at that. Uh, the big thing I need here are these guys, which are made by the crystals and the titanium glass, which I'm currently doing. So let's go ahead and let's get to my next planet. So I am in the sector. I have two planets at it at the moment. Let's see, is this the one I have? Yes. So I have this one, which I have not gone to yet. Uh, really doesn't have a lot that I need, especially since the other planet in the system has everything I could use. And so we're gonna go from there. We are fully powered up. Let's fly. Okay. Let's get a little speed going. We can cut that from a four minute trip down to something a lot more reasonable. Eh, 40 seconds is not bad. Okay. So, yep. Uh, so, pretty much what we are doing at the moment is trying to get all the research available to us so that we can pretty much research everything at the moment. Um, you can see at the top left, I'm kind of taking out a lot of the just smaller things that require uh, red, blue, and yellow, because those are pretty easy. If you were in the last uh, video, you saw that I did run out of purple. So I was like, you know what? Let me give it a little bit of a time to kind of like catch up before I just start, you know, hammering it down with lots of things. Okay, so we are landing and we are landed. Let's see. I think my base is that way. Yeah, I have a single stone pane going this way. Oh, that's funny. Okay. There we go. So you can see my planet. Very nice. Uh, we already have this thing set up. So what we are going to do is actually get that titanium glass over here. I want to remote and and I probably are gonna go let's let's say 2,000 for the moment so you can see the first 600 is coming in if you have not seen this before we're just gonna kind of zoom out for a second I got my little freighters they are gonna make their way here land and drop off that so now looking at that the next thing I do need are these crystals so uh, crystals are going to be Gotten from the one, the veins here, graphene, which I have plenty of, and then hydrogen, which I have hopefully been making enough of. Yes, looks like I have a good, good amount of hydrogen. So, let's land here. So, let's look at that one more time. The grading crystals, which I need to get from this vein here, that's pretty simple. Graphene and hydrogen, all into one. Uh, so let's see what would make the most sense to do. Especially since I have stuff kind of in a couple different locations. Because my graphene is here. Uh, the crystals are here. And the hydrogen is here. I mean, the hydrogen is here. We're going to grab a couple of those. So uh, let's see here. Well, we can at least get two of these three things done. So let's go ahead and get the mining part of it done. That seems like it's the easiest.
And I really don't, I think I have some, I have some space in here. So I think that's where I'm gonna go with this. We're gonna do a little building, get this guy over everything else I need. And then drop it down, okay. So now I think we can do the same thing with the hydrogen. Okay, and then we can also, let's see, this is getting that graphene. But we can move the, we can move some of the graphene offline. I have no issue with that. Obviously you see this line is not moving, so not a problem with that. I guess I must have built in a slightly irregular part of my area. We're gonna disconnect that there. And of course, power and power there we go nice another little blanket off there you can see them getting produced okay so we're going production now and we're going to try to find a, a level spot in this area to try to do this it looks like it could be a lot tougher than i think we're gonna find out okay so that's one I don't need, I don't I don't like that one very much. We're just gonna go to here. And we're gonna try to get these two connected as best I can. Okay, so let's go in, in, in. I will need a low power here, which is good. I got that plant there. And from there we are gonna make those. Let's make sure we have enough stuff. Okay. Now we need a lot of hydrogen for this, so we might need to uh, use the speedier the speedier guys for this. Up oh, first crystal, wonderful. Let's go ahead and let's X that up, X that out. And let's X that out for the moment. So what I'm going to do is, just because of the amount I need for these, I'm just going to go with the faster build. I only need, I think, like two graphing, so I don't need that to be fast at all. That can take its time. Okay, cool. So we have our first crystals being made. Oh, oh I got both achievements on the same time. I like it. Wonderful. Okay, so now that we have those crystals, I add the glass, and I add that, I can actually make these chips. Okay. So that is probably a little bit simpler to move, so I'm just going to kind of go out to here. And move them very carefully into just a spot that I could get to. I don't really care at the moment. It's probably not going to produce crystals that quick. We're just going to get that going. There we go. Okay. We have our first 1,200 of those stored. So let's go ahead and let's get them out of storage. And we're going to kind of move this guy up here. And that guy that way. There we go. Yeah, because I don't think these... Well, even with the fast inserter, it takes a while to get. Oh, the crystals are not going to be made very quick. We're, we'll work on that in a second. We're just trying to make them first. That, that's goal number one. Okay, so quantum chips. And I think I need a power for... Oh, not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. X that out. I need the other chips. Where are they on this list? Not that one. Where is... There we go. 
Yep. Okay. And from that ship, that's where we gotta look back to a little bit. I need that ship. I need then uh, these processors. Okay, so let's see if we actually make them out of the planet. Why this is going, unfortunately, extremely slow. We're going to put a box out here for the moment because it's not going to make many chips at all. Oh, let's cut that out. Uh, we have everything on this planet, so let's see if we actually make it somewhere. Is this planet, like I said, it's a lot more optimized than my previous one. Super nice. But let's actually see if I make it. Wonderful. It's gonna we're get knocking out all those small little researches. 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 I'm not sure the word for it. Anyway. Okay, we need to make these guys. So uh there's two things. One, it's going to be silicone and copper. Which I don't think will be a problem. Just gotta look at. Oh, I wanna look at this one. There's silicone, there's copper. That's pretty simple. Okay. Let's go ahead and get that stuff rolling. Like I said, that is not a really hard thing to do. Okay, let's go ahead. One. Two, three should be good. And power. Cool. And go ahead and make my silicone. Okay, like I said, that was a very easy setup. If I come right over here now. Copper is literally over here, so pretty nice. That's a good spot. Oh, and looks like we're gonna need some more of those. F5 is good. Okay, we can actually do a little bit more base setup here while we're waiting for that. There we go. Like we're gonna need some basic quarters that will be like I said pretty easy so let's drag this this way up okay up and down we're gonna make it go way over here. gonna drag that guy that way oh, looks like I need some assembler machines too okay, that's not the worst thing in the world two three I could need more at some points so we're gonna have to probably see what we're low on and kind of grab it up there we go okay so first machine yes second machine Okay, so let's go ahead. Let's connect one. And connect two. Connect one. Connect two. You, my friend, are making those silicone chips. Oh, well, the music was pretty good, and then it just quieted right down. I guess go right here. 
might help if I connect it to the rest of the network. I just, you know, just a thought. Okay. That is a good little start. Let's just go ahead and we'll drag that out for a second. Okay, so while those are going, let's see where my normal chips are being made on this planet. If they are actually being made on this planet. Uh, I don't see any. And I might not make them. I mean, that is a... You know what might help me? If I do. Oh no, it's just, they move that slow. 3.8 a minute, jeez. I thought that thing was gonna be slow, but this thing's even worse. <laughs> anyway, not my problem at the moment. I'm looking for regular chips. Which I do not seem to make here. So. Yeah, nope, definitely don't, doesn't look like I make it anywhere. Okay, well that's simple enough. Let's look at it really quick. It's one of, it's one of the easier items because it started off that you'll need it for everything. Let's go here. Copper and iron. Okay. Yeah, like I said, nothing nothing complicated. So let's look at this. Okay. Iron and copper. Do I not make them right here? No, I don't. But I probably could. I mean, this looks like a simple enough base to make. I already have the iron in reserve over there. Yeah, that's my silicon base, which is already getting very full very quick. Let's just do it. That's yeah, really not a good spot for this, apparently. Okay. This is way too much iron. I am well aware of that, but I think it's uh, in pretty good shape. Okay. <laughs> it's just literally going to go on this path up here. Like I said, we're going to just... Well, the silicone chips, hold on a second. Yeah, silicone and those will make these regular assemblers. Like I said, I already have my silicone. So yeah, we, we pretty much can just make all of that pretty much right in this little area here, which is super nice. Okay, so let's see what we got going on then. Oh, I am mining the heck out of this. Now let's add another one then, why not? Oh, actually, hold on. Before I do that, this is... Oh, it's going to, to make roads. Useful. Okay. It is, I promise. Okay, so let's go ahead and... Hold a couple more of these. We didn't need five, but we'll go with five at the moment. Okay, so let's see what we have going on here. So I think we'll make it like right here. It seems like a good spot for it. These are my iron plates. So let's go ahead and we can, we can get them going over this direction. I don't know if I'll be able to fit a third in there, but we'll, we'll go with two for the moment. I'm okay with that. We'll see how it works. It's a little uneven, but apparently I like using this iron deposit for everything. And it's really close to what I need, so I really can't argue with it.
That is a really, I don't, I'm not sure what I'm doing here. Okay, anyway, that is whatever. Not my problem. Not my problem. That's what I'm going to call it for the moment. Yes. Okay. Oh, we're going to have to move that much closer. Yeah, you saw how long it was taking. That is not acceptable. There we go. There we go. Yeah, just enough. 40, at 45 a minute. That's a good amount of chips. Okay. Uh, that might be a little too close. Yeah, let's... You see what I'm doing, is I'm, I'm gonna try to run the same... logistics here, so I can actually get several chips at the same time. Alright, let's see, we need... Three, three, four. Let's just get a couple. Okay. And, and I'm not doing the basic, it's just because I don't have these parts quite as often on hand. So we're just keeping it with the basic. Most of the time, it's okay. Hmm. You know what might help? Mm-hmm. Might help. Okay, well, let's put down that other assembler before we get going with that. Let's see, we can do all three if we really feel like it. I'm not sure what the rate in this is going to be. Let's look at it. I mean, at 45 a minute, we might be in good shape. Let's go ahead and get those guys rolling. All right, 15. Oh, actually, yeah, perfect. That's 15 a minute. That will pretty much supply it to what I need it to. Again, we can do something a little bit better here. Where we... This kind of comes over here. And then this just comes, moves a little bit, and comes right there. Makes the same chips. And that will get us twice as many. And I think that should be fine for holding. If we need another one, we can put one somewhere. I'm not terribly worried. Okay, great. Okay, so now that we have that... Okay, let's look here. We have those. We have these. We can make these now. Okay, so let's let's go ahead and we'll make our first quantum chips. Then we'll probably call it a day. We're gonna take a little bit of a long ride for this one. That's for sure. We're making them right there. Let's go right here. Oh, I just seem to run out of assemblers. And I run out of everything. That's okay. Let's look what we have really quick. Because I need... I believe iron. My iron is over there. Those two. Okay, so, yes, we have all those chips going that way. We have these chips over here. 
So over here, we're going to go ahead and make our first bit of that. You, my friend, make that beautiful quantum chip. And what we're going to do here... Go on the other side there. I'm gonna take that out. So I, I keep hitting it. At 3.8 a minute. Gee. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, we'll, we'll get you a good 40-person a good 40, 40 head start there. And there you have it, our first quantum chip. And like I said, what our quantum chip is helping us do is now we add the quantum chip with this gravitational lens and we can actually make green research which unlocks a whole lot more things if you look up uh up here i know what a distance i'm making these and that is what you have to know and i probably should be saving it Right now, it's gonna be a second more before I have enough to do much with them. So let's go ahead and just box them up. I have about 205. Look at it's, it's a very slow operation, so it's gonna take some while to get to what we need to get for this stuff. But let's go ahead and let's see uh, what we can do. What's the power of this planet? Oh, we got plenty of power. Okay. I'm back over here, and I'm looking at that for maybe a later process. One thing we need to do is we need to speed up this process a lot. Because, yeah, it's even backing up back there, which is just embarrassing. Okay. Uh, this moves at 3.8 a minute. This moves at 11 a minute. So, three. What I can do... I should keep it fairly moving. So you are producing... I can never find it. Like, it just... My brain is just not comprehending what I need. There it is. It, it, it's just not where I think it would be. Okay, so let's get these guys both going. Here it is. Okay, there you go. Finally. That's not two. One. That one's not. Oh no! I don't want to upgrade it. I want to get rid of it. There we go. Okay. Quantum chips for all. build. Oh yeah, oh wow, already boosted all the need. Okay, let's go ahead and let's just put you into a box. I think we're in good shape for today. Like I said, I made my first quantum chips. That was really the biggest point of this episode. And hopefully, with all of that stuff going, it should now give me enough to produce a decent amount of these chips. So, and what we're going to do the next one is we're going to actually use these chips, put them together, and start making some greens. So, I hope you join me for that. And thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day.